Today I'm going to share with you what to do after you sign up and become a presenter with Unique. So first of all, you will go to your website. Um, it's going to be uniqueproducts.com forward slash. Uh, usually it's your name unless you put something else in there. So once you get to your website, the front page, you're going to go over here to my office, parties I'm hosting. Click on there, okay. Um, this will come up here. You're going to click over here on the green that says schedule a new party. Because this one is going to be for you, so you can click the little box right here that says I actually want to host this one myself. Um, Valerie Starkey's unique virtual party. We always um, click 10 days. You can't make a party longer, so we always um, recommend clicking 10 days. And down here, the optional party message, if you want to change something um, in this message and make it more personable, this is where you can do that. And then click Save My Party. Now after the party is saved, um, I just minimize this so because we're going to come back and we're going to need this um, URL address up here. So next I will have you go to your Facebook page. Just you know, log on to, let me go to my home page here. When you're at your home page for your Facebook, um, you'll see your profile picture over here to the left. When you scroll down, you'll see a thing called groups. And you want to create a group. So we'll click create group. Up here we have to click create a new group. This is where you're going to name your group. So I'll just name mine Let's say um, Valerie's Amazing 3D Mascara Party. And you always have to add somebody to your group. So I like to have you add your upline. I'm just going to add my daughter for the sake of this. Um, we always recommend doing a closed group party. So we click close group and then create. This is something Facebook just has you pick an icon. You don't have to pick one if you want to, just pick anything under the coffee cup. And the reason you don't add your friends right now is because as you can see, the party's not set up. We don't have a banner page up here. We don't have our postings in here. So first we'll go to do our banner page. Up here you'll see add cover photo. And we're gonna upload the photo. So let me see from desktop, um, here's my banner photo. So you want to have um, your banner photos like saved to a file on your desktop and we can get you several of those and Unique Picture Sharing is another site you should be a part of and it has some banners in there as well. Okay, so we're going to save that banner. Okay, then the next thing we're going to do, we're going to get ready to um, do a post. And I have, um, I like to have my wording already ready I have it over here so I'm going to copy and paste it in here. I'll show you in a minute some parties, some, a fake party you've been added to where you can just get some of this verbiage and copy and paste it yourself. Okay let's um, let's add a photo to this. It's going to be in the desktop. Find the picture. Here we go. Oh, my eyelash pick. So now the one thing we haven't done here, we have our verbiage, we have our picture. This is when we have to go back to our unique site. And I said up here we're going to highlight this. We're going to copy that URL address. And that's where we're going to paste it. Every single posting you have to have that, um, you need to have this URL address because that's where they're going to click to go into your party. And if you want to just test it, click the link. There we go, we're in the party. So we know that works. Okay, so now once your posting is up, you have your um, your verbiage, your link, your photo. Now we can go in and add friends. So you're going to click members. You're going to click add people. And you're just going to have to start clicking like the letter A. And then you will, um, I'm not going to add these right now because I've already done this, but I'm just going to show you here. Just start adding a few people as you go down. And then it'll get to a point, I think, when you hit 20 that it doesn't let you add anymore. That's when you have to click add. And I'm, I'm going to close this out. But when you click add, then you have to go back to members. Remember what letter you were on. Add people. And let's say you were on the letter C. 
and click the letter C and start going through those that way. Um, once you've added all your people, then your party is ready to go. Um, let me show you one other thing. Let me go back to the... A lot of times the very first post, I'll say something about um, this being an online party to um, shop here. And if you want to pin that to always be at the top, you just click the little thing here and you can put pin post. This will always be the very first post they see. And if you want to change it, you just unpin the post and then you can pin another post. So there you have it. There, your party's set up. You're ready to go. You're going to want to post something once in the morning, once in the evening. And um, sometimes you can even post something in the afternoon. If you get something exciting, someone sends you before and after pictures of their eyes. That's always exciting to, um, to post as well. Thank you so much for listening.